Hello everyone, my name is Anya, and in this video we're going to take a look at what happened on this day in the year 1998, the disappearance of Tom and Eileen Lonergan. On the 25th of January 1998, married couple Tom and Eileen Lonergan were on holiday in Australia when they decided to go on a scuba diving trip. They were a part of a group of 26 people who went scuba diving in the Coral Sea. But due to an incorrect headcount, the couple were accidentally left behind when the boat transporting the passengers returned to shore. Incredibly, it took two days for anybody to notice that the Lonergans are missing when a bag containing some of their belongings was found on the boat. Immediately, search and rescue teams set out to try and find the couple. But by then, it was already too late. Despite an intense search, Tom and Eileen Lonergan were never found. In the months following their disappearance, diving gear belonging to the couple was found washed up on various beaches. Some of that gear included their diving jackets, one of Eileen's fins, and this diving slate containing this eerie message pleading for help. Unfortunately for the Lonergans, help arrived too late. While it was initially speculated that the couple could have faked their disappearance or it was a potential suicide, the coroner and their families believed that the couple succumbed to delirium and dehydration before ultimately drowning. The Lonergan's disappearance is the inspiration for the 2003 movie Open Water, which features a similar event where a couple is left behind in shark-infested waters. MV Outer Edge Dive, the company responsible for organising the trip that day, pled guilty to negligence and ultimately went out of business. The case of the Lonergan's proved to be an inspiration for tougher regulations regarding the safety of divers at sea. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. My name is Anya and we've just looked at what happened on this day.